Okay, so spring is definitely in the air. It is gorgeous outside. One must-do destination is the Auburn Spring Home Show. There you'll find hundreds of exhibits focused on indoor and outdoor living at its finest. And you will also find these lovely young faces. You're looking at the students of the Placer High Art Department. Along with them, we have their fantastic teacher. This is Kaya. And Kaya, you are a part of this amazing program that has created what is called I believe garden buddies, if you will. This is something that people can find at the um, Auburn Spring Home Show. But tell us first, so exactly what are your students here creating right now? So we were lucky enough to get a bunch of garden tools donated, and each student then had the opportunity to paint um, whatever they wanted. And so um, some of them are creating some really amazing portraits, some flowers, um, any number of different things to put in your garden. Okay, excellent. And then I'm also seeing too. We have a shovel here that uh, has, a, it's pretty much, would you say, cut out, engraved? Yeah. What, how would you yeah. describe that? So Seth is my um, master welder over there, and he... Um, Which one's Seth? Wave, Seth. There's Seth. Hey, okay, Seth. Nice job. And you did that. Seth made that. Seth That's created incredible. that. Yeah, we did a little collaboration on it as far as I helped with the picture, but he did all of the hard work and um, learned from that one, and now he's creating a new one, which is going to be an amazing fish. Okay, and so these are obviously amazing pieces that we can have in our garden for decoration. Uh, any functionality with this? Some of them are absolutely functional. Mm -hmm. um, the ones we brought here are more for um, your viewing. Display. Yeah. Yeah, and mm -hmm. some of them you can put outside. Some of them you may want to even put on your wall. Okay, now we know who Seth is. He's the master welder here. Right. Um, Seth, what grade are you in? I'm a senior. You're a senior. Okay. Yeah. And go ahead, sweetheart. We're going to have you introduce yourself on the Hi. end here, too. I'm Amy. I'm a junior. The junior. And over on here, you're busily painting. Introduce um, yourself. I'm Allie. I'm a junior also. Okay. And gentleman right here. I'm Diego, and I'm a senior. Okay. All right. So we have some incredibly talented students here, uh, all inspired by this amazing teacher. Um, and I understand, you know, you've you've been recognized by uh, the Auburn Rotary, right, for Teacher of the Year. Yeah, last year. Yes, okay. I honestly personally feel that you should also probably be recognized as an ABC10 Teacher of the Month, which, by the way, students, you can nominate her for. So go to abc10.com. Um, but we want to highlight, you know, some of the amazing work and the influence that you've had on these students because from what I hear, you love to encourage your students to create, right? Absolutely. Okay, why do you find that so important? Um, I think it's so important that kids have the opportunity to find something they love and explore it and um, really find value in self-expression and in their education. Um, and I think art is a beautiful place to do that. I totally agree. And students, okay, I'm going to put some pressure on you. In one word, I know there's some juniors, so this still may impact your ability to graduate. But in one <laughs> word, describe your teacher. Go. Encouraging. Uh, artistic. Um, I'd definitely say inspiring. Pedagogic. Oh, whoa! <laughs> Teacherly. Okay, okay yeah. how about that? That's a nice big word, too. Okay, um, so clearly you've made a very positive impact on your students, so congratulations on that. And so much that now you're able to sell these items. They're going to be at the Auburn Spring Home Show, and it goes towards a very important cause. Absolutely. It goes towards our department. Um, we are going to use it to help uh, further our education as far as go out, have shows, go on a field trip, see actual museums and whatnot, um, and just help educate our future artists of the world. And so, so continuing to expand the educational opportunities, Absolutely. the learning opportunities of these of these great students that you're already inspiring and lifting up. So, so thank you. Thank that's, you. That's very exciting. And I just want to hear really fast, you guys. What do you love so much about what you're doing? That this product's pretty unique in itself, right? Yeah. Yeah. So, so what what did you like? About painting? Yeah, about being able to um, paint these garden tools. I liked how I could paint it however I wanted. Mm -hmm. I could express my artistic ability mm -hmm. in like my own way. And, and what about what about getting to cut into a shovel like that? Well, I like it a lot more. I'm not super into the whole painting and stuff. Mm -hmm. So when Miss Una started talking to me about her ideas and she wanted to actually cut something out of the shovel, I immediately wanted to do it. I tried a few different ways and mm -hmm. started to narrow it down how to get a good one. Wonderful. Okay, great. So once again, you got to express yourself, right? Exactly. Paint wasn't so much your avenue, but cutting into metal certainly is. Yeah. <laughs> okay, and how much will these be um, at the uh, Auburn Spring Home Show? Um, ranging anywhere from 20 and up, um, depending how much time and how much creativity kids put into there. Excellent. And as mentioned, it goes to a great cause. Uh, Auburn Spring Home Show is when and where? Auburn Spring Home Show is this Friday, Saturday, and Sunday at the uh, fairgrounds um, right in Auburn. Excellent. And everyone, as mentioned, make sure you head on out, uh, purchase these tools for a great cause. 
and look for these lovely fresh faces at the event. This interview involves commercial content. The products and services featured appear as paid advertising.